Betting on yourself is the single most important thing that you can ever do. Forget investments in cryptocurrencies and assets in shares in businesses, stocks. The single most important thing that you can do is investing in yourself, but most importantly is betting on your future, is betting on yourself. You know, I see so many people and it really frustrates me. And this is why I always say that a lot of young men, the reason why they're not successful and the reason why they're not where they want to be and they're not achieving the goals that they want to achieve is because they don't bet on themselves. They don't have that belief. They don't have that trust in themselves. You see them bet on players like Cristiano Ronaldo, Messi, or you look at the boxing and they'll bet on Tyson Fury and they'll put down 100 quid or $200 and go, yeah, if he wins, I'm going to get X amount of money and back in returns. They're constantly betting on other people. They never, ever bet on themselves. Motherfucker, how about you do something in your life? How about you start that project? How about you complete your studying? so that you get your diploma. How about you start your business and you see it through, you finish what you started, motherfucker. So now you can reap the rewards of something that you personally done. Instead of getting a measly 150 pounds back in return, the odd occasion here and there. Instead of betting on the horses, on the dogs, going to Cheltenham, going to the Ascot racing. Wherever it is, betting on other people is the worst thing you can ever do because you are vicariously, you are constantly vicariously living through other people's successes. Why don't you do something with your life? It's why you are not where you want to be. Because you're not betting on yourself. You're not investing on yourself. You tell yourself it's too expensive to spend that amount of money on a gym membership. You tell yourself that it's too expensive to purchase that studying course, to invest in knowledge, to invest for your future. But you'll happily spend £200 on a night out. You'll happily do that. You'll happily spend money on your negative indulgences your your bad habits that are going to lead you to nowhere on instant gratification activities but you refuse to spend a single penny betting and investing in yourself it's why you're destined to lose it's why you're never ever, ever you're never ever going to become successful because it's the mentality it's, it's the mindset that you've cultivated it is absolutely the mindset that you've cultivated if it's meant to be it's up to you you hear that all the time it's fate it's destiny if it's meant to be it will find me I agree to that to some extent, but if you sit there and do absolutely fuck all with your life, you're never going to attract what you need to attract. Success is not something that you chase, but instead it's something that you attract. It's you attract by the person that you become. It's the things that you do on a daily basis, the habits, the activities, the time that you wake up in the morning, how productive you are with your time. It's, it's not rocket science, but it ultimately comes down to your mindset. It's, am I going to spend 50 quid? on Erling Haaland scoring a hatchet this weekend, or am I gonna save that 50 quid that's gonna to amount to 300 pounds in savings so I can purchase that course that's gonna enable me to gain the knowledge that I need so I can invest in this business or I can start this business, or I can invest this money into an event that's gonna enable me to network and connect with this individual that's gonna put me in touch with this person so that I can become a business partner in this field. It's all about the long game. It's thinking long term. It's betting on yourself. It's investing in yourself. It's the most important thing you can ever do. And believe me and trust me, I've made that mistake. I've had the successes of investing correctly. I've had the failures. I've lost money because I've spent it on frivolous pursuits. I've done the mistakes. Guys, trust me when I say that I've been there and done that. I've spent stupid money on betting. I've spent stupid money here on match days, going to the football, doing this, doing that. And I'm not saying you can't have fun. You can absolutely have fun. But it's all about balance to a certain extent. But it's understanding what your ambitions are, what your aspirations are, where you want to be. And if you want to become a winner, if you want to elevate and into the upper echelons and into the top five, top 10%, you have to make these sacrifices. I always, I always state this on this channel. And I've made the mistakes of throwing away thousands into stupid investments on crap little coins and stupid assets stupid stocks wasting it on clothes that i never needed wasting it on holidays guys i've been there i've wasted the money i've spent years in the midst of mediocrity i have i've made the mistake and i've learned harsh lessons across there and i've been in misery i've been in despair depression times and i've come out the woods i've come out on the other side and now that I've made those mistakes, I know what the correct thing is to do. But why? I have the clarity because now I bet on myself. I have the confidence and believe in myself to say, you know what? Why would I spend money and time 
investing into this person, this individual, when I can spend it on myself, when I can gain that knowledge, develop myself, develop my skill set, whether it's mentally, physically, spiritually, develop my skill set so that I can become a better individual, so that I can bring more value to the marketplace. Every time I think now in terms of purchases, in terms of investment or time that I'm going to use, I always think about, okay, cool. What is the ROI for me? What is the return on investment? By providing value here, how is that going to benefit my life going forward? How am I going to benefit the lives of others? I can only benefit the lives of others. I can only add value to the marketplace if I become more valuable as an individual. Because I am no good to the marketplace if I don't develop my skill set, if I don't become a better person. So by betting on yourself, by investing in yourself, you are ultimately helping the people around you because you become a better person and you elevate and raise those around you because now you're adding more value wherever you go, wherever you invest in. But it all comes, fundamentally, it all comes down to the choices that you make today. The best time to plant a tree was 25 years ago. The next best time to plant a tree is today. Very famous quote by a very wise man. And one of my favorite quotes, famous and favorite quotes Success is the progressive realization of a worthy ideal. Success doesn't necessarily mean that you become a millionaire in 90 days, but it's having that clarity, betting on yourself, understanding what you're aspiring to become, understanding the goals and the vision that you have, and chipping away slowly, chipping away slowly. As Abraham Lincoln once said, if I had seven hours to cut down the tree, I would spend the first five hours sharpening my axe. I know I'm paraphrasing that, but you get the picture, you get the point that I'm portraying here. Betting on yourself is the number one best thing that you can ever do for your future, for your life. To not only help yourself and elevate into the top 10%, but to ultimately help those around you so that you can raise their game, you can elevate them and bring them up with you. But you can't do that if you don't become a better individual, if you don't eradicate bad habits, if you don't incorporate positive habits. You know what you need to do in life. You don't need me to tell you that. You know your personal life better than I do. You know what you need to do to become a better version of yourself. But the decision is down to you. If it's meant to be, it's up to you. Smash the like button, subscribe, hit the bell notification, and I'll see all of you guys for my next video. Peace.